Well, hello, darling. How are you? How are you, darling? How are you? Mm -hmm. What's up, guys? Babes, it's your girl Joy back with another banger. Too much? How you doing? Okay? You okay? I'm not sure how this lighting is. I just got to the classroom and it is 6 48. So I'm gonna try to give y'all the tea. I know I've been gone. I know it's just uh, I get home from school, child, and I just be going to bed. Bed. Really? It seems like all I do is be at school, go home, do more schoolwork, maybe watch a little bit of TV, and then I'm out. And then when I get to school, my mind is so crazy. I be coming up with stuff. So when I get to school, I be scrambling to do what I came up with on my drive to school. And it's been like that. So I just, just, woo, woo. Then I'm like, maybe I'm at the end of the end of the spectrum on you in the tube. So maybe I'm done for. Maybe I'm throwing in the towel, throwing in the ropes, just throwing it in the fire, just. Throw it, throw it back into yesteryear and like sit down somewhere and just be old. Sit down somewhere and act your age. Sit down somewhere and just be like, you know, like you almost a hundred, half century. But sit down somewhere and act, act like you tired. You, you out of touch with reality and you about to settle in for the long haul. Sit somewhere and just b so i don't know i don't know y'all y'all see my glass y'all like my glasses i call my personality glasses you know it gives you a little character honey i got these from vogel me vogel me something instagram be getting me. i'm like mm, it might arrive and it might not but should i give it a try mm -hmm. so i did order these these were like 20 dollars, and i got me two pair i got this pair and I got a black pair. Let me show you the black pair. Hold on, hold on. Calm down. Just calm down. So these are the black ones. They go in a little bit. Can you see a difference? Probably not. But these are the black ones. The other ones had a little brown. And they were a little square at the bottom. So I don't know. I don't know if you could tell the difference. You, you, let me, you let me know. Okay? So I have duty today. I didn't know what to wear. So I'm not wearing anything fancy. But just if you want to see it. I had on a robe. Not a robe. Like, but it's, an, it's, it's to wear outside. But I, I'm hot. I don't know. Maybe it's that change coming, honey. You know that change. So I was hot this morning. I was like, mm-mm, this is not going to work. And it just felt kind of roby to me. It just didn't flow right to me. So I just said, mm-mm. So I threw this on. I've worn this before, I believe. So this, it is what it is. I got my little thrasher shirt on. So for the thrasher shirt, I cut the sleeves off. You know, but you know, I got cover up at school. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? So I love my belt. I got my little sneakers on, okay? I wish I had lights on these puppies. I had sneakers with lights, honey, but they done burnt out. They were so old. They used to be the kids' sneakers when they were about seven. So, you know, I guess it just had its run. It was like I'm tired. Just like I said, maybe they need to retire. Maybe they need to sit down somewhere. The lights went out on those shoes, honey. The lights were like, I, it's over. The show's over. The curtains closed. I'm throwing down. The fat lady has said she... It, so, anyway, I'm going to go put out the cones. I put them out early so when the bell rings at 8, my stuff already set up. Yes, and I have to wave to the parents. Wave here, wave there, wave everywhere. All right, all right, look, calm down, calm down. So the T, Bobby came home for spring break. Spring break, I ain't do nothing. I ain't do nothing. Sit around, think about school, went to the library, thought about school, planned stuff for school. Just school, school, school. It's just like I don't know how to turn it off, but I haven't learned that technique yet. So it just, I'm just going, going, going. So I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. You a teacher? I'm always a teacher. It just doesn't turn off. One of my kids email me. Not a lot of students email me, but if they email me I, and I get a ding on my phone, I do email them back because it's something about, you know, I can't open this document or something. So it's just real quick. It's not a lot of time that I have to put into it. So it's like maybe five minutes. 
and I'm done. And that doesn't bother me at all. It's not like all my students, and it's not a parent. No, I did talk to one parent. She was like, no, just wait one day. No, no, it's okay. No, no, you don't have to. Uh. I'm like, I'm sitting in bed watching Gilligan's Island, so it's not a big deal to me. Uh, uh, I don't mind, I don't mind. I'm just sitting here anyway. And she wasn't mad, that was a good thing too. She was just curious about something, so I had to let her know and give her the T. Why her daughter does not have an A, so the daughter has an 88. It is what it is. Sometimes you, the little smart one's gonna have a little challenge and a little challenge is good. You know, everything can't be easy. It'll come easy to every kid. Sometimes there's a challenge and then you learn and then you grow from there. Anyway, listen, calm down, calm down. Baby, so Bobby came to the school, honey. She came to the school and she talked to the kids. So I had the kids write questions for her on a sticky note. So I gave Bobby all the sticky notes from the kids. She created a Google Doc, honey. She created a presentation. She created a masterpiece. And she spoke to the kids about her work ethic, her homework, her study, how to study, how did she achieve such greatness. And they was like, Miss Basil, Miss Basil, Miss Basil, but we only don't you have one kid, Miss Basil? One kid. I didn't know you had two. I said, no, I got three. I told you I had three. I told you uh, my situation with my son before. I said, what you want to hear? Sydney went to church today. Sydney went to church. Sydney met with her Bible group. So it's like, you know, Sydney is fantastic. Sydney is wonderful. Sydney is wonderful. She is sweet pumpkin pie. That's a little moody sometimes. And I just want to tell her to go to her room and don't come out until <laughs> she can move out. So anyway, but you know, she don't talk back and all that stuff. I don't, I don't deal with that with my kid. Mm -mm 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 -mm. No, we, we're not having that. No, no, no. <laughs> no. You know, because then I have to turn into the Hulk or somebody. But no, nah, she, she just get a little moody. I was like, do you have your, your period come out? I'm like, dang. So I just walk away. I don't deal with that. I don't deal with that. So she, she moody. I don't deal with the moody with Bobby. So, Bobby, it's just, it's just that Bobby has achieved other things that the other kids haven't achieved. You know, Sydney is straight A's. She's straight A's. But, you know, you know, Bobby had all the chords and, 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 you know, awards and accolades. And so there are different things to talk about when, when there's accolades. You, does that make sense? I don't, I, don't, I don't want people to say, oh, no, no, it's bad. It's just that the accolades that Bobby has, I just talk about them. Sydney is great. She does a lot of things at church, but the accolades are not the same. You know what I'm saying? What I'm saying now, she had, you know, oh, she was student of the whole school district. She was honored by the superintendent. Yeah, I'm going to talk about it. But, you know, I'm like, oh, yeah, Sydney got another A. She got, she, you know, made a 90 on her test. Yeah, Sydney. So, and then I did ask Sydney if she wanted to come to school with Bobby. She said, no, but, but Sydney, and I did tell the kids, I know Sydney, she had other responsibility at school that she didn't want to miss that. She says, no, ma, I can't miss this class because, you know, I'm hanging on by a thread. She's trying to hang on to that. Hey, she said, I can't miss this. I think it's calcul um, something I can't spell. So... So she didn't come, but I did offer to come. But Bobby came and she spoke to the kids, honey. If I could put in a little clip, honey. She yeah, so just to encourage you guys a little bit, if my teacher says, you know, this is going to be on your test, then I would just write it down so when you're studying, you'll see it and you'll just remember it. And that's an automatic question you'll get right because this kid already mentioned that it's going to be on your test so you'll know it. Um, and so when it comes to testing and stuff, you guys asked me a little bit about that. And I kind of like to say you test how you study. And so if you study a lot and that kind of takes away some of that testing anxiety because you study the material so you're a little more confident that you know it. And so some of that testing anxiety will just go away a little bit. And so when it comes to studying, I don't like to cram whenever I study, like studying the night before or procrastinating a little bit. Um, because you won't remember things as well when you cram it all in, all this information in and just the night before. She did the thing. She did the thing. She spoke. She they asked her questions. It was great. I wish she could speak to the whole school about work ethic, studying, and whatever your she was talking about. Whatever you put in now, whatever the habits that you're creating now, those are the habits you're gonna take with you later. So if you're not studying, you're not doing your stuff now. They're probably gonna follow. Cause I'm gonna try to get this up. 
today because i know i know y'all but sometimes i just be like dang i don't even know if people still interested you know what i mean so i'm like Boo. i was like youtube didn't blow up for me i'm like it probably won't but you know i'm not it, it just quiet quiet look calm down calm down. Mm -hmm. calm. that's not the real tea we still got issues with her car child Ooh, jesus is a friend of my oh just terrible terrible so anyway listen 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 calm down but baby Here's the TT. Let me change my location and give y'all this tea. I may need a seat because I had to have some shit. My lips dry. Can y'all see my dry lips? Ooh, they just dry they peeling, y'all. Ooh, it's like I can't even move the bottom lip. Because it got cracks. So, child, big bad. Calm down, calm down, okay? So, honey, let me tell you. So, I got a call, right? So, I was like, hello, how you doing? And it was clear. And I was like, so where you been? I haven't heard from you in a minute. You know, how's it going? How are things? Well, things are not so great. Uh, I wanted to ask you, you, you think, you think I could come home for a little while? Say what now? What was that? Come again? Oh, you realize it's hard out there. It's hard out there for Joy. Gotta remember where you at, girl. <laughs> All right. It's hard out there for a teen. Shucking and jiving, trying to be an adult. It's hard out there for a teen. No, he's an adult. He's almost 21, honey. He's almost 21. He'll be 21. 21 this year. Yes. Yes, honey. Yes. So, Sydney will be 18 in July. So, then I'll have 18-year-old, 19-year-old, a 20-year-old, and then in August, he'll turn 21. So, it'll be 18, 19, 21. Baby, so for one month it's consecutive, you know, and I really did feel bad kicking him out But now he has a taste of what it's like and I said, well, what happened? Why? Why? Where did you go wrong? He said I wasn't always response. I wasn't always responsible with my money blah 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 So, you know, my heart broke when you know, he was initially kicked out. So I said, okay, no problem You know, my little heart couldn't do it again. Like, oh, well I couldn't do that. I said, but you got to have a plan, son. You got to have a plan. So he was there for a couple of days, and then he went out of town with his friend to some a, a wonderful lake house, honey. Wonderful, wonderful. I asked him, so what's your plan? You know, a time frame? What do you have? What are you doing? W what's going on? What's going on? Mm -mm. You got to give me something. You got to give me something, honey, because you know we went through this before. You didn't have a plan, and you weren't trying to come up with a plan, but you need one. <laughs> I think a week later, I didn't want to stress him. Yeah, stress him. Mm. A week later, he says, I know what I'm going to do. He says, like, June, he's going to transfer to another college. Um, I think uh, University of Houston or U of H. I don't know what it is. And he says, you know, I can live on campus there. And so I'll get a place with my buddies. So I was like, okay. And then he's going to transfer because he works at, you know, grocery store, really nice grocery store. So I was like, oh. That sounds like a great plan. So we still sticking with school. I said, are you passing away? He was like, yeah. He's really a smart boy. It was just, you know, you have to execute. You have to put in the effort. But now that he's paying for school himself, out of his own pocket. And also, I do feel bad. But it, that's just way the cookie crumple. That it was just the deck of cards I was dealt. It makes it harder to not having a car living in Texas. It really does because we don't live um, in a bus line. That's not the area where we live. So there, there are no buses. You kind of have to have a car or you're relying on other people to drive you around. Because baby, Sydney done took over my car. But that's a whole nother story. So listen, listen, listen. I want to start uh, trying to save to get him a little car. Because I know you're limited. You're very, very limited when you don't have a car out here. So got to try to save up, give him a cash car, y'all. To, to, to help the little boy out. He does have a plan. And he's, I haven't seen him since spring break. I think he came back once. He's been gone. I don't know where he is. So I guess I'll send him a text, see where he is, how he's doing. But I don't helicopter my, my kids. I don't helicopter. It is what it is. And therefore, I, I also trust them and trust them to do the right things. And when, once you turn 18, in my mind, you grown. You grown. Hopefully, you making the right decision. And all the things that I've instilled in you, hopefully, you haven't lost your mind or lost your way. He's doing well. Bobby's doing well. Sydney's doing well. 
So, knock on wood. So I wanted to give y'all that tea, honey. Baby. Uh, Bobby will be back March 1st. So she gets out of school. I was like, good, then you can come back to school with me. <laughs> I'm still getting my heart looked at. I did a stress test. That was a three hour test for a stress test job. There was one inconsistency with the stress test. So there was one little thing. So I have to go back for angiogram. That's when they, I don't know, it's, it's, a, it's a little invasive where they put a little camera and die and go through the groin area and go up to the heart and if they need to put a stent if there's a little blockage they'll they'll do that that day so we'll see and i'm supposed to um have a baby aspirin a day which i haven't been too good with that so i need to get some more baby aspirin so i'm supposed to go monday but i'm not sure how much that's gonna cost so i may have to postpone that it's just terrible how we have to make these decisions over our health because of money so I don't know, I have to, I have to, I have to see. So other than that, that is the update for baby. There are about 41 days left of school. And I, I kind of don't want it to end because I don't really do anything during the summer besides think about school and plan and think and think and plan and think and plan. So I do want to try to do something, <laughs> maybe one little thing over the break. I kind of would love to go home too. Uh, maybe even go home with the girls. We haven't been home a long, long time. Um, just like a two-day trip or something. Take them where I grew up and stuff. So it'll be a nice going down memory lane. And there are certain foods that we love when we go back home and certain places we have to go. Other than that, I hope you guys are doing well. Just wanted to give you an update. So I hope I could find a little bit of time to edit this video for you very quickly. I do have some things to do. The kids are working, still working on a, a project that's due today. And baby, I know a lot of kids, mm-mm. It is what it is. At this point, if you don't know what you need to do and you don't care, I can't make you care. Cause I've been working, working, working. I'll email parents, tell them that this is due. Baby, most of the time they don't even read it or they don't tell the kid. So I'm just like, I'm not even gonna talk about that. Cause you know what? Today's gonna be a good day. Today's gonna be a good day. Get the negativity out of my face. I want positivity in my face. Today's gonna be a good day. Today's gonna be a good day. Today's gonna be a good day.